Welcome back to the Real Crypto Space. I'm your co-host Louis. And I'm your co-host Hamza and today we'll be talking about cryptocurrency taxes and how to file your taxes. But before we get into that, please make sure you subscribe and like, it really helps us with the algorithm. So make sure you go follow our Instagram because it's the easiest way for you to get through to us and you'll be notified whenever a video comes out. Alright, the tax date for the US is going to be on the 17th of May and that's still far away, however it's different from the UK. So each place you are, you need to check when your tax date is and you have to file your cryptocurrency taxes or your capital gains taxes before the tax date. The UK cryptocurrency tax date is on the 5th of April, so there's still a few days left, around one week left. So you have to prepare yourself and get ready to file your cryptocurrency taxes or any capital gains taxes for your stocks or commodities or shares that you hold of a company. So there's various sites, but we recommend Recap to uh, file your taxes. Uh, so basically what it does is it reads your finance or whatever exchange you're using, Coinbase, KubeCoin, it reads all of your transactions and then it calculates your tax for you so you do not have to do any work so there is a free version of this which allows you to do up to a hundred transactions um, but if you want to do more then uh, you want to pay for a plan uh, but most people are going to be over a hundred transactions unless you're just holding so you can import all of your data and here is uh, all of the exchanges that you can uh, do it with um, so if you, all the main ones, Qcoin, Bitpanda, Polyanex, Bitfinex, Bitstamp, Binance and Luno. Um, so that's what most people are using. Um, and the way you would do this is connect it via API. So uh, whatever connect, whatever um, exchange you're with, you should know how to do this. Uh, if you don't, just a quick Google search will tell you how to do it. Uh, if you're already importing your um, uh, transactions into an app like Block Blockfolio, it'll be the same way of how you got your API doing it that way. Just a quick note, Recap can only read your transactions, it cannot take your money or do any withdrawals or any deposits or anything like that, it can just read, not write. There's many different types of stuff that people are unsure about on what is actually taxable, so selling cryptocurrency for fiat, so let's say you want to sell a cryptocurrency such as Cardano and you want to swap that for USD or GBP or even USDT, that's a taxable event and that also will be included in your plan. So trading crypto for crypto is also a taxable event. So let's say you want to sell Bitcoin for Ethereum, that's a, that's a taxable event. Paying for goods and services with cryptocurrency, that is also a taxable event. And mining cryptocurrency for some people that mine it and through graphics cards, that's also a taxable event. Earning cryptocurrency through staking and um, liquidity pools, that's also a taxable event. And uh, rewards from staking, lending and referrals, taxable gifting or donating cryptocurrency and other taxable event airdrops for example if someone wants to send you cryptocurrency and they're near you they can send you that through an airdrop and that's also a taxable event so all of these add up and they'll all add up to your recap plan and it will basically go through what can be taxed and what can't be taxed so for the UK tax um, how recap gets sorted you import your trades and that recap um, sort out all your tax stuff so it calculates your capital gains your share pooling methods and gives you all the information and reports need for your HMRC self-assessment returns so for the US uh, for what is taxable is the exact same for the UK so selling crypto fiat all of these um, so for the US what recap does is they import your trades and they do all the maths for you so they calculate your long-term and short-term capital gains and auto generate forms so the steps you'll do for using Recap is you'll connect your exchange, uh, so you'll upload or it will do automatically your, all your transactions. It will then check for your gains and losses, see your crypto holdings and view all historic trades and transactions which will check for your capital gains. Uh, and then you'll then download your tax uh, report and you'll know how much uh, you are owed. Okay, Recap has many different types of plans that you can do. So there's the free option which you can do forever, that's only 100 transactions and um, it allows two connected accounts so let's say your your account and your dad's account you can use the free um, launch pad that recap offers and it basically inclu includes portfolio tracking so you can track how much money you've made um, through your profit and loss you can also in-app support so if you have any um, struggles that you come up um, um, come up on then in-app support through sort of just customer service they'll help you throughout your struggles and also capital gains and, and losses that you will um, 
be seen in the free version as well. And for the paid version, the lift off in orbit and moon it allows you for over 1,000 transactions for the £120 a year one and 5,000 tra transactions for £240, um, £240 a year and 25,000 transactions for the moon and that's going to be £400 a year and it also allows you an infinite amount of connected accounts and includes everything that the launchpad includes however it has all your downloadable tax reports and margin gain and loss income so uh, the good thing about recap is you're encrypting your data and it's not them so all the data you had to recap is encrypted and only you hold the keys to decrypt it so they can't see your data it's only read it's not it's not written so they can't use it share it or sell it which protects you from breaches and other threats so other companies aren't actually telling you the truth this is why we chose recap because they claim all your data is encrypted by them with their keys before they store it in their database which means they can decrypt it and see everything otherwise they won't be able to show you your data uh, they also claim our employees must go through a background check and what recap say is uh, they would hope so since they can collude to access your data it only takes some social engineering, a bribe or a mistake and employees become a leaky faucet for your sensitive financial data they also claim we will never sell your cryptocurrency data to third parties that is until someone offers them enough money or until they get bought out best to assume that if they can sell it they will I've never seen a company do this where they actually call out other companies yeah. like they could be just trying to make themselves look better but I mean I can see what they're saying and it is true um, but then again yeah cryptocurrency is a risky business so there is irreversible transactions um, so whenever you send money uh, you can't get it back not like with a bank you can charge back and privacy is so your security so if no one knows your digital keys then no one can take it uh, so as long as you only have it and it's in a safe place and you have multiple copies of it then uh, you, you'll be good so how does recap protect you so it has client-side encryption private data sharing direct connections to exchanges and secure and secure infrastructure you obviously have a recovery phrase which protects your uh, crypto anywhere but then they also have a browser extension which protects your exchange data in transit Thank you guys for watching The Real Crypto Space. Uh, that is the end of the video now. And uh, may I remind you, please, please go down below and subscribe. Uh, I think only 5% of you are actually subscribed. So please, please subscribe. It will help us out a lot. And uh, we're doing videos every weekend. So every Saturday and Sunday and every Wednesday as well, video will be out. Uh, so yeah. And uh, also please uh, go follow our Instagram, man. That's enough from us. Thank you very much.